So we're at the end of Storage Gateway, and here I have a Storage Gateway cheat sheet which summarizes everything that we've learned. So let's start at the top here. Storage Gateway connects on-premise storage to cloud storage, so it's a hybrid storage solution. There are three types of gateways, File Gateway, Volume Gateway, and Tape Gateway. File Gateway lets S3 act as a local file system using NFS or SMB. And the easy way to think about this is think of like a local hard drive being extended uh, into S3, okay? Uh, volume Gateway is used for backups and has two types, stored and cached. Stored Volume Gateway continuously backs, backs up local storage to S3 as EBS snapshots. And it's important for you to remember that the primary data is on-premise. That's, that's what's going to help you remember the difference between stored and cached. Stored volumes are between one gigabyte to 16 terabytes in size. Cache volume gateway caches the most frequently used files on premise and the primary data is stored on S3. Again, remember the difference between where the uh, primary data is being stored. Cache volumes are one gigabyte uh, between 32 gigabytes in size and tape gateway backs up virtual tapes to S3 Glacier for long archival storage. So there you go, we're all done with storage gateway.